Guys, I just wanted to post up a quick video on the progress of this uh, iPad 2 install. If you've seen my previous video, you've noticed that uh, the iPad actually uh, sticks out from the top. The AC controls are located right here. And the uh, radio is actually on the bottom part. So, some of my goals here was to uh, keep it as stock as possible. Uh, bring the iPad down so you won't see it from the outside. Because I don't want anybody to break in. Um, so in order to accomplish that, I had to, one, for one, move the iPad down and also to the right. And because of the space, since I wanted to keep this body line all the way around to keep it stock looking, I had to cut into this piece here and cut the uh, AC almost in half. Um, and then another thing I had to do is push the AC controls down and build this uh, little pod here. Um, so it, it turned out pretty good. I mean, it looks probably as stock as I get it. Um, so I just want to show you guys real quick how it works. I put a uh, faster motor on this one. So just got to push right here. It pops out right away. And the thing that I had to do is rebuild that bezel because how thin the uh, iPad 2 is. So it just slides right in right into place and locks right into uh, its location there so then just hit the accessory button turns the unit on there's no jailbreak uh, for the iPad 2 yet so once that comes out I'll be able to have the auto on auto off display out to the uh, headrest monitors uh, and everything else that comes with that um, so real quick uh, you can see here playing everything through the aux in on the head unit so it's actually a better location to have it right here because it's closer to the iPad for when you change the volume and you also have better uh, viewing angle um, another thing is I put a line of code on the iPad so it'll give me the multitasking uh, gestures so as you saw there instead of using the home button I can actually just use four fingers up to go to the taskbar I can minimize without uh, hitting the home button. Another thing is I could um, switch between applications. So in this case it's a four finger swipe. So you can see there. And then to go back swipe, back, swipe four fingers to the left, to the right, minimize and you're good to go. Um, one of the main goals on this install also was to make it really, really easy to take the iPad in and out because I'm going to do that a lot. So as you can see here, just um, let's see, just push the button, slide it out, and within three seconds, it's already out of the car. Put it back in, slide right back in there, slide into place, and I'm good to go. So I think I accomplished uh, that goal there, and that's pretty much it. Another thing I wanted to point out is that I put the uh, microphone for the Bluetooth right there. Pretty good location to get uh, my voice, and it comes out pretty clear. And I maintained the uh, push start at the same location that was at before. Uh, and the AC, I haven't had any problems. I, I know I cut this in half. But I still get uh, all the air I need from there, and it works out pretty good. And it still swivels with no tension or anything. It just easily moves back and forth. Another thing I wanted to accomplish is uh, utilizing the camera on the iPad 2 for FaceTime. So I want to demo that real quick. I had to drill a little hole here for the camera, and I think this is really where it comes in handy to have that swivel uh, mount on the iPad 2. Uh, so let's try that out real quick. So you can see there, it's a little dark because it's really bright behind me. Um, but as you can see here, it's got a pretty good angle on me. But if I push this button, it's got an even better angle. Uh, so that's just another uh, benefit of this install. Another thing is that uh, I put the suede all the way around um, on the inside 
and on the front so whenever I slide the iPad in and out because it has a suede right here on the this little lip here it actually cleans all the fingerprints and everything from the iPad uh, so I just I guess another added bonus of this install uh, so that's pretty much it